You a fan? Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Lifelong fans. What's your favourite movie? Uh, first the Devil Dracula. Rides Out. The first Dracula. And why do you like it so much? Oh. It's, it's his screen presence when he's on, when he, especially when he plays Dracula, he just puts a smile on my face when I watch him. It's brilliant. Is he the only face that screams to mind when you think of Dracula? Yeah, the only one. Why are you here to see Christmas? Uh, well, it's my favourite uh, <laughs> film star, or one of his you know, biggest fans. Why well, Christopher Lee? Uh, mainly because of Dracula. Who do you think of Hammer has for him? Oh, brilliant, <laughs> excellent. Have you got it in the I think I should carry on mate, you know, come up with some films, you know, carry on mate, some more horror films and that. There's I mean, films I've got now is good. Uh, well, I just like Dracula. I've liked him ever since I was about six years old. Uh, I'm a grandmother. I've just come to keep her company. You're not particularly a Christopher Lee fan? Well, I used to watch him when I was younger. So do you like particularly about Christopher Lee? He's a sort of suave vampire, isn't he? Well, he was, yes. <laughs> <laughs> when I used to watch him. Very nice. Where are you at the back there? Yeah, hold on. We've got some uh, sleeves for him to sign in there, some video sleeves in there, yeah. We've got loads of them. And uh, what is particularly appealing about Christopher Lee? Uh, I think he has an enormous penis apparently. He does like porno films in his spare time and um, he's very good at them. But we haven't got any seasons of him because of like bands in his country. But um, apparently um, he's a very uh, good actor as well. Yeah. And and we like his acting. And you think there's a future for that Yes, I think um, I'm actually producing the next one uh, called uh, ha House of Wax Part 2. Yeah, producing I'm producing it. Yeah, so we start, we're starting next next month. Oh right, and uh, I mean, are they different from the original Hammer? Is it going to be more money, more special effects? Uh, yeah, they're sort of about, about the same. We're using um the, the budget is obviously going to be a lot bigger, yeah, than before. So why are you queuing up? Can you uh, jump the queue? Uh, no, I'm going to surprise him. We're going, to, we're going to sign him up today. We haven't signed him up yet. We're going to try and sign him up for the project today. Did you say your name and the title of your producer? Yeah, my name is Jason Pike. I'm on producer, yeah. That's okay, thank you. Um, I'm here to see Christopher Lee today. Uh, mainly because of Dracula, the, the first film, 1958, which he starred in with Peter Cushing. Um, I wish they would personally bring uh, Hammer films back. Um, with, the, with the looks of the queue today, I don't see why they're not making movies like it anymore, like this, like the films that he's been in. And what's the particular appeal to you? Um, I think his, his strong presence on screen as, as playing Dracula. Um, I think uh, his glaring eyes and... What are you going to say to him when you meet him? Um, I'm going to probably ask him what his favourite film, uh, Hammer Horror film is, probably. That what one is, what his favourite is. Okay. Why are you here? Um, wait, waiting for... Because he's a vampire, he's the vampire really. Are you a vampire? I'm not a vampire, I wouldn't be out this. <laughs> no real vampires, but as far as the images, it's Christopher Lee. And uh, why do you think everyone associates Christopher Lee with a vampire? Um, yeah, but have you seen everyone else? No, no one else has done it as well. So, what do you think specifically about him? Sort of um, noble features. So, uh, just the whole thing. I mean, it's nothing. I couldn't say any one particular thing. I do hope so. Well, it's how can you? I mean, they they were what they were. You can't remake them. You can try. It would be a different thing. It won't be the original Hammer Horrors oh, film. But, uh, I'll wait and see. <laughs> um, it's just the whole image. Uh, he's just you know, the, the vampire, him and I bet Lugosi. It's just uh, him. His presence on screen is just amazing. Yeah, it's very It's good.
watching it. Well, go on then, answer it. Um, because we've sort of grown up on his films, I guess. And why do we all associate him with uh, just vampires? He was just saying he's only ever played a vampire five times. Um, it's because he looks right for the part. <laughs> he's just the uh, too tall and uh, menacing. Menacing, I think, is the word. It's, uh, he's just right for that role. Do you think there's a future for Hammer House Horror Movies? I heard they were trying to start up again, actually, so um, it would be nice, but I think they'd have to sort of grow up a bit from the uh, sort of effects they had in the 60s. Well, do you think that's not part of the hallmark, the tackiness, low budget? Yeah, but it's fun to sort of like grow up with that kind of thing, look back on it, but you can't sort of have a new movie that looks like that, really. He appeared in Dracula and a lot of the, a couple of the others, but I thought one of his best roles was in The Devil Rides Out, where he played a good role, and that was one of my most enjoyable films. And, uh, do you think it's fair that everyone associates Christopher Lee with the, the archetypal vampire? No, I don't think so, because he's done a lot of other films. Off the top of my head, I can't really think of one, but he's done. Uh, he's got a very wide, uh, very wide scope of uh, films that he's done. Yes. And uh, do you think there's a future for Hammer House Horror Movies? No, because I think that uh, I think that the films were uh, in that day that uh, they epitomised the, the tackiness was uh, was the essential thing. <laughs> I think the tackiness was it, and uh, I think they should be left where they are um, and not be brought back because I think that the Hammer Horrors uh, can't really be restored because of the people. Uh, Peter Cushing and Christopher Lee and all the others, you know, you can't really bring them back. <laughs> oh, why Christopher Lee? Why is Christopher Lee so great? He's just one of the best actors there was. He was great. He was just like out of all the films and everything. My dad used to talk to him on the bus as well years ago on the way home from work, so he's a gentleman, he used to say, so one so of the best. A gentlemanly vampire, is that his appeal? That's it, yeah, most definitely. And uh, do you think there's a future for Hammer House horror movies? God, yeah. Hopefully they're going to start remaking them, apparently, so, yeah, definitely. A queue here today proves that, doesn't it? It's immense, isn't it? Yeah, that's How right. are you willing to wait? Until we get to see him, hours. Yeah. doesn't matter, yeah. And what, what are you going to hope to say to him when you see him? I don't really know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> My dad used to talk to you on the bus years ago. Excellent. What about you? <laughs> Particular Christopher Lee, Brett, why, why do we associate him with this sort of archetypal vampire, do you think? He's so good with it, I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> so he sort of brings the image over quite well, I think. And do you so think uh, if they're remaking the Hammer House of Horror, if they sort of put high budget into them and everything else, it's going to sort of lose the spoil it a bit, yeah. <laughs> do you have a lot of Hammer House of Horror movies at home? A few, yeah. yeah. What's your favourite? Devil Rides Out. It's about the best, I think. And of course it's got Christopher Lee in it, so... <laughs> what do you hope to say to him if you, when you get there? I'm the clue. Same as my friend here. <laughs> <laughs> So, why are you waiting in this immense queue for uh, a brief meeting? Yeah, just to meet this brilliant guy, um, very sweet, Christopher Lee, yeah, I love him. And uh, do you have a lot of Hammer House Horror movies yourself? Yeah, a few of them, yeah. And uh, why, why do we associate him with the Archetype of Vampire? He's quite a nice guy and... Uh... Um, I don't know, I just... Um, yes, he's brilliant, I love it. I'm not English, I'm Swedish. Right. So I just come over to see him. It's yeah, yeah. is, he, is he big in Sweden? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thank That's you great. Nice. Hold on. Okay, so why are you waiting for this Oh, because it's a big chance for us because we're from Brazil and we wouldn't have any other chance of meeting Christopher Lee and he has many, many friends out there. And so you made the trip especially to see Christopher Lee? No, it was a bonus of our trip. Today, yeah. Today, uh, today we've come real special to, to see him. And, uh, and why, why is he such a good vampire? My favorite is Bela Lugosi. <laughs> I think he has a style and he has done much thing for, for the horror movies, new horror movies. 